you know, Romans 8, 1, <clears throat> that is, you know, amazing chapter. You know, I, if you've asked me, you know, what's the first thing you should teach a new Christian? And that is the difference of Romans 7 to Romans 8. Romans 7 guy is a guy trying to live righteous, but he can't because he's spiritually dead. Then when you get to Romans 8, he's talking about <clears throat> a Christian who is born again, does have the life of God in him, and he says, it's the law of the spirit of life in Christ Jesus has freed me from the law of sin and death. So no longer am I a Romans 7 guy stuck trying to do something I can't do because I'm a sinner. Now that I'm born again and I want to do the righteousness, now I can do it. That's the law of the spirit of life in Christ Jesus. Jesus came to set me free from having to commit sin. I no longer have to commit sin.